I love diving. It's very fun and you can discover a beautiful world underwater. Look how many fishes. Look, a starfish. It's beautiful. <laughs> Phoebe, are you looking for mermaids again? Mermaids? Mm, not sure. But there are lots of crabs at the seabed. Phoebe, mermaids don't ig... What? What is it? A mermaid? A shark! Wait, it's a baby shark. Where are his parents? Don't worry, we'll help you find them. Submarine mission. Finding the shark family. Wow, a clownfish. Let's ask him. He's with a surgeon fish. And a turtle. Haha, <laughs> like in Finding Nemo movie. They may know something. Dory, have you seen any shark? What a great idea, Groovy. If you transform into aquatic animals, you'll be able to move underwater more easily. Well, not always. <laughs> Seahorses aren't really agile. We're learning a lot of animals today. Let's ask him if he's seen your family, baby shark. Excuse me, Mr. Seahorse. Have you seen any shark? Miss Dolphin, did you see a shark? Mr. Swordfish? Jellyfish? Whale? No, don't worry. Fish have a really bad memory. I'm sure someone has seen them, but can't remember it. We'll have to look for clues. Look, is that a fishing net? Hmm. They seem scared. Let's go and check. Baby shark, your parents. Oh no, we have to hurry. You'll have to cut the fishing net faster. Good job, kids. Do you remember the name of all the animals we learnt today? Yes, starfish. Crab, really good. Yes, clownfish, like Nemo and his dad. Great, surgeon fish. Sea turtle, they can live more than 100 years. Seahorse, what a beauty. Jellyfish, careful with them. The intelligent dolphin. Whale, huge. Shark, how scary. Let's take care of the ocean so they can all live happily. Grandma 
shark do 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 Grandma shark do 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 Grandma shark Grandpa shark do 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 Grandpa shark do 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 Grandpa shark do 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 Grandpa shark Hungry sharks do 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 Hungry sharks do 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 Hungry sharks do 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 Hungry sharks Little fish do 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 Little fish do 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 Little fish do 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 Little fish Swim away do 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 Swim away do 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 Swim away do 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 Swim away Swim faster do 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 Swim faster, do 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 do. Swim faster, do 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 do. Swim faster. Swim faster, do 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 do. Swim faster, do 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 do. Swim faster, do 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 do. Swim faster. Swim faster, do 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 do. Swim faster, do 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 do. Swim faster, do 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 do. Swim faster. Bye-bye, sharks! Oh, are you going to the beach? That's awesome! What are you carrying in there? An umbrella? A towel? Sun cream? Arm pans? Toys? A float? Very well! You definitely have everything you need to have a great day at the beach. Broccoli? Radiator? A coat? Groovy? You don't need these things at the beach. Oh, Groovy, you first need to use the sun cream. You don't want to get sunburned, do you? Look, like Phoebe does. Oh, that looks like fun. What's that? A shark? Oh, it was a dolphin. Dolphins are really friendly. Why don't you play with him? Guys, I think someone is calling you.
Johnny, Johnny. Yes, Papa. Eating sugar. No, Papa. Telling lies. No, Papa. Open your mouth. They are when they're sleeping. Something smells delicious. It looks like Groovy can't resist. No, Groovy, not yet. Wait until everyone's at the table. Why don't you go wake Phoebe up? Really? Nothing? Maybe you should try again, but in a more loving way. Come on, Phoebe, it's lunchtime. Broccoli is super healthy, Phoebe. You should try it. No, no, Groovy, that's Phoebe's plate. We know she's going to love it if she just gives it a chance. Right, kids? Oh, no. Phoebe's starving. Of course. She's weak because she hasn't eaten her vegetables. Wow, Groovy. That broccoli has made you super strong. Don't worry, Phoebe. There's always a solution. But... How are we going to get back home? <laughs> Yummy! Remember kids, vegetables are healthy and tasty treats that give you all the energy you need to play non-stop. Phoebe, your ladybug costume is super cool. Ah, <laughs> Groovy, your cat noir one is awesome too. Wait, why is the park so dirty? People should use the litter bins. That's it. Phoebe, great idea. Superhero's mission, clean the park. Really good, kids. It's sad that people throw trash on the floor and the water. Let's do our bit. Each bottle we collect, it'll be a bottle less in the river. And then we recycle them. Hmm, a little more. Almost. Careful, Phoebe. No. Groovy, help her! Cristiano! Haha, <laughs> well done, Groovy! Now, children, you have to be more careful. Don't worry, I have an idea. Come, Groovy, let's take advantage of the fact that everyone believes you are Cristiano. Kids, listen. Cristiano Ronaldo's going to teach you not to throw rubbish on the ground. You must recycle. We can't throw rubbish on the ground, but deposit our rubbish in the corresponding containers. Will you help us to clean the park then?
beautiful. Thank you all, kids. Every country organizes recycling in a different way. Ask your parents how you should do it. And try it like it's a game. Very good, kids. What was that? It's okay. Don't worry. That's cool, Groovy. What is going on? Let's find out. The street is under construction. I think it's going to take them a while. I think we have to get used to this. They still have a lot to do. How? Already? Hmm. This is weird. Kids, do you think Phoebe and Groovy should help? What fun! A new adventure! Construction machines are broken? And they couldn't finish the work. They can't by himself. He needs our help. Phoebe and Groovy will help you. Hmm. Groovy can transform into anything. Right, Phoebe? For example, into a drill. Uh, well, um, what about into an excavator? No, Groovy, be careful. Boxes are fragile. We better try with something else. Demolition crane? No, no, this was not a good idea. I know. Groovy, why don't you let them operate you? They're the expert. The street looks great. Hmm, Pops, what are you up to? Pops has opened a portal. Where does it go? Pops, have you brought us to the era of dinosaurs? We are at the Jurassic. Wait, kids. This can be very dangerous. Phew. At least we have Groovy who can transform if we need it. This Brontosaurus seems very nice, though. Those T-Rex, not that much. Kids, look. What's that? It's a dinosaur egg, like the one in the book. And it's in danger. Groovy, you have to do something. Kids, we must save the egg. Groovy, you can. It's there. Oh, oh, run. Kids, how do you think they can do it? Pops, I have an idea. A pterodactyl, that's right. Now you can save it and take it back to its nest. Well done, kids. They're like the ones in your book, Phoebe. Do you want to keep playing? Well, what kind of dinosaur will they be? Brontosaurus? 
No, Phoebe, they can't be Brontosaurus egg. Brontosaurus are huge to live on top of this little hill. <laughs> Tyrannosaurus Rex? No, Groovy, they can't be from a T-Rex. T-Rex can't fly, and it would be too difficult for them to feed the babies. <laughs> That's it, Pops. It must be a dinosaur that can fly. Do you already know what dinosaur it is? Exactly! Pterodactyls! <laughs> oh, and they think that you are their mom. Oh, that's their real mom. She's very grateful. Good job, kids. Oh, wow. What a long day, kids. It's time to go to sleep. Good night. That's the way I like it, kids, to wash your teeth after every meal. With a little bit of toothpaste is enough. Be careful, Pops. You're going to create a magic portal. Groovy? Oh, a baby dinosaur. Hello, baby. Don't cry. Groovy, please transform yourself into something. Something that babies like. I do not know. A pacifier. Groovy, look at your steak, Groovy. You're full of dinosaur slime. What do you say, Pops? Yes, okay. Children, Pops is right. Our little friend has sneaked into the present through a magic portal. We have to travel back in time to find their parents. Is that all right, little dino? Pops, please open the magic portal. Ready for a time-traveling adventure? arrived. Welcome to the Jurassic. It turns out that before humans, the Earth was inhabited by these huge dinosaurs. What do you think? <laughs> Groovy, we need a vehicle to escape. No, Groovy, no. Something that goes faster. Run! They are T-Rex, the most dangerous dinosaurs! Good. We've given him the slip. We'd better find the parents of our little friend. This Jurassic is dangerous for a human. Two Martians and a voiceover. And now what? Oh no, another dinosaur is coming. Luckily, he has come to help us. It's a harmless Triceratop. Oh, it's your mom. What a happy coincidence. Well, kids, problem solved. He can come back to present. This must be his dad. Oh, poor, he has a Flemigan. Of course, as at this time, they did not wash their teeth. It is normal that it hurts. Groovy, could you help him? <laughs> circles, circles, up and down, three times a day, and smile, smile, smile. <laughs> Goodbye, friends. Kids, not so fast. What are you forgetting? Right, you have to brush your teeth. Remember, to the dentist you won't go if you wash your teeth more. Hello, 
kids. Today is a very special day. It's Halloween. Phoebe, do you have your costume ready? No? Still no costume? We need to fix that. Sure, there has to be something inside that closet to dress up Phoebe and Groovy. <laughs> what is that? Is someone there? Mom and Dad. Lucky you. They've brought you new Halloween costumes. Children, what do you think Phoebe and Groovy will be wearing? Whoa, your costumes are awesome! What a clumsy fall, Groovy! Be careful! Look how many kids have costumes! So fun! Are we going to ask for candies too? Cool! Hey kids, do you know what you have to say now? Exactly! Trick or treat! Great! They've given you lots of candies! <laughs> Groovy doesn't like them though! He likes broccoli more! Hmm, Groovy! Where are you taking us? This house is a bit far away! I think we'd better come back. <coughs> Groovy! Don't enter inside! Watch out! Bump. That cat is like a watchdog. Oh, it's a house of a witch. Oh, thank God. It's just a granny. Groovy, you don't have any costume. Transform into something for the trick or treat. Trick or treat! Groovy has gotten away with it. He's pigging out on broccoli. Remember, kids, if you do not want to have your belly hurt afterwards, do not eat all the goodies at once. Happy Halloween! There's nothing better than a great breakfast to start the day. Right, Groovy? He has eaten his and Phoebe's. Time to go. Phoebe is so hooked on her new mystery book that in the end, she will be late to school. When you are in a hurry, the best is the tricycle. No traffic jam, no contamination, and you do some sport. Oh no, you got a flat tire and we are in a hurry. Who could have been? Good idea, Phoebe. This is a mystery for a super detective. Groovy, Phoebe needs a magnifying glass. Help her. This is a case for Phoebe Holmes and Dr. Groovy. Today, in the flat tire mystery. What a hole! To find the guilty, the first to do is look for clues. Hmm, what?
what do we have here? Hmm, three clues. First one seems like a dog footprint. Second one, a human footprint. And third, a bird footprint. Where should we start? First one. There we go. Number one clue, dog's footprints. Careful, Phoebe. That mutt looks suspicious. Let's question him. Groovy, transform into a dog and take his bone. Mr. Dog, do you know something about the flat tire of this girl's tricycle? The dog is not guilty. He has an alibi. He is chained. Poor dog, he couldn't leave his garden. It's really late, let's hurry up. First clue wasn't good, let's continue with the second one. Second clue, human's footprint. Another false clue. These are Phoebe's footprints on her way from home. Third clue, bird's footprints. Solved. It has been this woodpecker that has pierced the wheel with its beak. It's elemental, my dear Groovy. Let's go, kids. There's no time to lose. The mystery has been solved, but not the problem. We can't use the tricycle, and you have to arrive to school on time. Have you thought the same as me? the skin of your teeth. Remember kids, if you want to arrive on time, you have to leave with time. You never know what can happen on the way. Clues are needed to know that this mischief has been Phoebe's idea. Elemental, my dear children. Look, I've brought a board with many foods. Will you be able to distinguish which ones are good and which ones are bad? And place them in the right box? Sure. Okay, prove it. Remember healthy food at the left box and junk food at the right one. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Wow, so fast. But let's check. Kids, what do you think? Is everything in the right box? I think you have simply put in one box the things that you like and in the other and the things that you hate to eat. That wasn't the idea. Groovy, why don't you help her? Groovy, that's not a real broccoli. <laughs> you have to reorder them, not eat them. <laughs> Groovy doesn't like chocolate bar at all. They are totally unhealthy. Exactly, Phoebe. Lollipops aren't healthy. Great, Pops. The unsweetened yogurts are very good. What else is in the wrong box, kids? I know you can do it.
Well done, Groovy. <laughs> Phoebe doesn't like the texture of the bananas. But if we blend it, she just loves it, right? Blend the fruit is a great tip to make kids love them. It's delicious. So, is everything right now? Really good, Pops. At home, we spend lots of Sundays cooking healthy desserts as cookies and cupcakes to take them to school. But the ones we bought, unhealthy. How would it be then? Healthy food. Watermelon, banana, and other fruits. Carrots, broccoli, zucchini, and all the vegetables. And also natural yogurt and other dairy products such as milk and cheese. And junk food. Cookies, chocolate bars, ice creams that have too much sugar and fat, also lollipops, chips, or french fries. And about soft drinks. Even light ones are unhealthy. Better to avoid them. What a lovely day to go on a field trip. But if Groovy doesn't stop singing, it's going to start raining a lot. We've arrived to the Astronomy Museum. Look, Groovy, it looks like a flying saucer. Oh no, we've forgotten the solar system model inside the bus. Now you have nothing to show at the science contest. Kids, we have to reach the bus. Groovy, transform into a motorbike. A motorbike toy? Damn, the bus is already too far. We'll have to improvise. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> Groovy, it's just a little spider. Stop playing with a telescope and look for something to build a new model. Hey, hey, kids, it says private. That means you can't enter inside. Hey, listen to me. Shh, children, you can't be here. But Pops, are you misbehaving too? Don't erase that. What are you writing? It's not understandable at all. Look for something to build a new model. Great. And now let's go. The contest is about to start. Ah, <laughs> Groovy, you're hopeless. I know you love fruits, but you almost ate the whole sun. Children, the judge says you have added one extra planet. Which planet is that, may I ask? No way. It's Groovy and Pop's planet, sure. But that planet is still unknown to anyone on Earth. Kids, let's remember the planets of the solar system. Around the sun, we have First, Mercury. Second, Venus. Third, Earth. Does this sound familiar, Earthlings? Fourth, Mars. Fifth, Jupiter. Sixth, Saturn. Seventh, Uranus. Eighth, Neptune. And ninth, what planet is this? Oh, Groovy. <laughs> I can't believe it. Pop solved the formulas of the laboratory's whiteboard. Now the scientists know where she has to look with a telescope to find, exactly, a new planet in the solar system, Groovy and Pop's planet. Oh. 
Kids, a new planet of the solar system has been discovered thanks to Phoebe and Groovy. They had already included it in their model. Haha, <laughs> okay. And thanks to Pops who solved the formulas of the whiteboard. Groovy, a new planet of the solar system has been discovered. Remember kids, science can be really cool, but you'll have to work hard to discover something new. Peas, peas, it's time to eat your peas. Yes, 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 I want to eat my peas. Good, good, the peas are good for you.
the bus go swish, swish, swish All through the town On the bus go chat 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 chat. The people on the bus go chat 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 all through the town. The horn on the bus goes beep 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 beep. The horn on the bus goes beep 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 all through the town. Morning, kids. I brought you here to learn the colors all together. Phoebe, let's go over what you have learned at school. Groovy, pay attention. We have six paint buckets of different colors. Red, orange, yellow, green. <laughs> exactly, Groovy. You are green and yellow, too. Blue and pink. We also have six drawings of animals. Fox, frog, chicken, ladybug, flamingo, and shark, like baby shark. Animals are so cool. Do you know the color of each animal? Groovy, transform into a brush and help Phoebe paint the drawings with the right color. Which of these animals are red? <laughs> exactly. The ladybug is red. Groovy, now orange. Hmm, what will it be? Yes, very good, Phoebe. The fox is orange. Yellow. Groovy, you try now. Which animal is yellow? No, no, Groovy. Flamingos aren't yellow. Kids, help him. <laughs> That's it. Chicks are yellow. It's Green's turn. <laughs> yes, Groovy, you are green. What other animal is also green? Yes, the frog. Blue. Like a baby shark, yes. There's only one color left. Which color is the flamingo? Exactly, pink. Very good, Groovy. Hmm. I think you know all the colors perfectly. Do you want to try with the fruits? Groovy, you now all by yourself. <laughs> with a little help, it's okay too. We have tangerine, strawberry, banana, blueberries, pataya, and kiwi. What color is the tangerine? Exactly. Tangerines are orange. And the strawberries? <laughs> Very good. They're red. 
and the banana. <laughs> Yellow, that's right. And little blueberries? Aha, <laughs> blue. What a team! There's only one left, the pataya. Very good, kids. Pink. Great, kids. Last time. Red, like a ladybug or a strawberry. Orange, like the beautiful fox or the delicious tangerine. Yellow, like chicks or bananas. Green, like a frog or the inside of a kiwi. Sure, and broccoli. Blue, like the baby shark or the blueberries. And pink, like the flamingo or the pataya. <laughs> and like pops. Yay! Learning is so fun. Hey kids, why so bored? Let's go out and play. We can learn to count. It's gonna be fun. Okay kids, let's learn to count. One. There is one Groovy. And one Phoebe. What else? One dog? That's it. Next, two. There are two. Exactly, flowers. One and two. Very good. Let's see. What's the next one? Three. Perfect. One, two, three. That's it. Next number is four. Right there. There are four penguins. One, two, three, four. Cool. Which one is next, kids? Ha ha ha, exactly! Five! Five baby sharks! One, two, three, four, and five! Next number, six. Look to the sky. One, two, Three, four, five, and six. Come on, Phoebe. You have to pick up seven ducks on time. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, <laughs> seven. To count to eight, I have an idea. Hey, Groovy. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, and eight. Let's count up to nine now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. <laughs> and ten. How much fun! Do you think you remember all the numbers? It's your time to count by yourselves. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good! What are you doing? Are you trying to say something? Oh, yes. Subscribe, kids. Groovy the Martian, official channel.